Hey guys, it's MacPats here, and today I'm bringing you a video on how to prevent Apple revocations on your side of loaded apps. Uh, this will prevent enterprise certificates from being revoked, so if, let's say you use a signing service or something. Now, it's worth noting, signing services, there's a big discussion going on on, on, si on the side loaded subreddit about whether they're actually safe to use. Um, so I'm going to assume that if you're watching this, you're following this tutorial, that either you're taking a risk and you don't care really, or that that's been resolved and that we've determined signing services are safe. So the first thing you need to do is you just need to open up Safari and paste in this link, which is appeven.com, and you need to download their client. And this will prevent um, the support re revokes in every signing store, and not just appeven. So if you use App Valley. Um, tweak box, etc. Anything. This will prevent revokes in any of the applications. And you have to keep, uh, to keep app even installed because the actual profile that prevents revokes is linked to the actual app even app. So once this is done installing, should be any second, you'll have the untrusted enterprise developer error, which is normal, just gotta approve the developer. So yeah, as you can see, you should be able to just enter the app now. And when you do, it'll ask for some notifications and a few other things I'm not going to. So yeah, so here it asks you if you're going to use a VPN and yes you're going to want to click allow and you're going to want to allow it and add the VPN. So it'll send you back here and at this point you can just you know hide happy even in a folder somewhere and forget about it um, because it's not important anymore so you just need to go to settings and then you see the app even VPN is just connected. Now you don't have to actually have the VPN on at all times. You just have to make sure that this connect on demand toggle is toggled on. And that's all you need. You don't need to manually switch it on like with this with this toggle at the top that breaks it sort of. You just need to make sure connect on demand is enabled and it will prevent your certificates from being revoked for most most of the time it will prevent re revokes um i ran this profile for around two months uh from march to may and i had one app get revoked when i had around six or seven side loaded apps on my phone so it has a very high success rate of blocking uh revokes but it you can get revoked so if you have games and stuff or stuff that uses data uh, you're going to want to make sure it's backed up or if it has an online function you have account linked or something. And uh, it's also worth noting with the original anti-revoke VPN, which is patch by now, when you turned on your phone from like a, um, from a boot up, if you didn't turn on, if you didn't unlock your phone in the first, I think it was 15 seconds, then your apps would get revoked. I don't know if that's why mine got revoked or if that happened with this VPN, but I would just, uh, I just do that. Just open up your phone. When you're in your phone boot, just quickly sign log in. So that way you won't risk getting revoked. So uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick tutorial on how to prevent revokes. And um, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.